balance, good at all three levels. Look for him to get the ball out of his hand pretty quickly tonight. Looks to throw, gives it to Ezra Gray, running left, being chased, hits the corner, and trying to make the game safer for everybody. He did that block against Jamel Dean, who's been dealing with the busted up right hand. Up correctly, like Deshaun did right there. This drive going in the wrong direction for Alabama State on second and 22, and it's dropped. This is one of the loneliest feelings in the world, so I understand some early miscues and nervousness from the Hornets. Pearson, good running quarterback, wants to take off. He'll slide down from their own 19-yard line in their second possession. Quarterback D.J. Pearson. Pearson with time. He throws. He's got a man wide open. Dooley Artisde. They play the kind of football they're accustomed to playing. First and 10, Alabama State from the 30 of the Tigers. Pearson bouncing around. Run the football tonight against those big uglies. There's Ezra Gray trying to bounce it out left. Because of the way the rules have changed in the offseason and no more two days, you don't get quite as much tackling as you used to. On third and 11, the left-handed throwing quarterback delivers it. Or something. That's not how Coach Mal Malzahn rolls. It was something they've been planning for a long time. Yeah, he said we've been practicing it for about 37 days. Just a gunfighter type guy, you know, who would go forward on fourth down a lot. I think he wants to get back to kind of his roots. He says we're, we're at our best when we're aggressive. So look for Auburn to be a little. Hornets 0 for 2 on third down so far tonight. Pearson, first down catch. Alex Anderson is in the backfield. Pearson gives it to him. And it's five. They get the playoff in time and hand off. Anderson can't turn that on the defense. There are a lot of leaders on the defense, but he said the emotional leader is Davidson. On third and long, the pass towards the sticks, a diving attempt. Pearson, oh, picked off that route, red and brought most penalties they had in the game in four years. Talesian Farmer is the bat, and he has the carry, and he powers his way forward right up near the. Pearson going to give it back to him. Not much there for Farmer this time, though. Just to those are two characters right there. Two love, big characters. Love both of those guys. Alabama State on a second down and nine. Pass by Pearson is caught. Made an Auburn defender bite and got a big completion. Anderson. Now Five of 14 in third down against a really talented quarterback in Jake Browning. Looked like there was some movement on the right edge. No flag and then Pearson just slings it out of bounds. Trying to get in and out of breaks quicker. I like the changes they've made. Pearson on the run and a big linebacker coming downhill. That's a tough call. Seven penalties for 57 yards against Alabama State. Pearson a little issue with the snap. Now throws and just nobody in the direction. Oh, a lot of good music going on here. A lot of energy in this crowd tonight considering the opponent. Hand off Alex Anderson. They were miserable of having to face these guys every single day. And I, I know that feeling. It's no fun having to face a defensive like, line like this all the time. Pass a little low, but be interesting to see how it plays out this year in the college football playoff. Always exciting to watch it unfold down the stretch. Looking for somewhere to go. Pearson, who's got good wheels, headed towards the sideline. This quarterback's Michael Fink. Don't, don't <laughs> at me. There aren't many of those guys out there. Pearson trying to set up a oh. screen pass. And third and ten for the Hornets. Pearson going to take off. They could move it to 20 and then get stapled down. Situation where we need to practice this and get some live reps and kickoff. Plus, you see in the preseason, he is a monster. Uses his hands so well. Oh! My God. Trying out a new quarterback in Dakota Rocker. Yeah, Rocker. Rocker. A little hesitation, but he'll run up towards already. Flag down. Rockers pass. Rocker, decent amount of time. Sees a little crease to take off and then slides down. Over Jane did. Ricky I like Haley. the robe, though. Ricky Haley with the safety. He's a guy that some NFL scouts have been taking a look at for Alabama State. Here's Talesian Farmer carrying. No game. Find a way to, to get in shape. 
Farmer hit, and he's going to be tapped. No doubt. Yeah, the defensive line is they're the heartbeat of this football team. They got a lot of leaders up front and a lot of guys who play with a nasty trick. I really like this defensive line. Rocket fires a fastball. That's one that Coach Malzahn and Kevin Steele might let go a little bit. Flag down. Carry for Farmer. One of eight on third down. The Hornets, here comes some pressure off the edge of the sack for Derek. I love the way he runs. Got to take care of the football. Had a fumble early, but has been sharp otherwise. Dakota Rocker played quarterback the last couple of series for Alabama State. He's back out there. And... Back to Farmer. Talking about it all night, the way they get off blocks. They fire their hands into the chest of the offensive lineman. They make it really tough to find running room. As we're game, guys, we're going to get a bunch of snaps this season. Rocker hands it off to Ezra Gray. Right back to the line of scrimmage and a quick toss. Marquez Spencer. Why you practice? Why you pay attention to detail? Why you do the little things the right way? Has swung out by Rocker to Gray. And I have a feeling they're going to be putting up. Some similar, if not better, numbers this season with the kind of personnel they have on that side of the football. Dakota Rocker delivers, and it's caught by big recruits coming here, and they want to play for that guy right there. He, he brings a lot of excitement to this side of the football, and people love playing for him. Rocker's pass, bat. Find a way to get your hands up and interrupt some passing lanes. Hornets going to go for it on fourth down, oh. and four in the sack. Out for Booker to recover. So the Alabama State offense back on the field couple of weeks not getting any love at all but I like Kyler Murray that offense is gritty they're gonna be tough for defenses to face in this defense bunch of talent in the wings at Auburn Dakota Rocker steps up fires across juggling a tip in years are gonna be really good years down here at Auburn and you, know, you look at the kind of recruiting classes they have the coaching staff they have in place there's no reason to think otherwise gray still has a long way to go to get the first that disappear and lost. What do you see for next weekend's? Kadaris Davis. Stratosphere yet. Joe Burrow played a good game, and I think he's got a potential to be a very good quarterback. I'm just not sure he's going to be ready for this kind of environment. Collegian Farmer. He's had a couple of very nice runs for Alabama State. Over into next week. Obviously, have a guy like Jared Sidham, who, in my mind, is. As good as Joe Burrow was last week, it's still not in the same conversation of a guy like Jared Stidham. And that was a trendy pick this week was South Carolina over Georgia. And I fits well what they're trying to do in this offense. And I think we're going to hear his name called pretty early, possibly even next season in the NFL draft if he has another good year this year. Zone for the first time. Their only points came on a safety. I can, I can assure you. Bade into the end zone and completes. I can assure you that uh, the ones right now are tuned in very closely watching these young guys do their work. Davis on the rollout in trouble and he's going to be sacked. So he got four sacks tonight already. He had five in week one against Washington. Big numbers by this Auburn defense. Davis a shot towards the end zone. McCreary covering again but in the corner. Making a little more history tonight here on this SEC officiating crew. And off C.J. Leggett's. Leggett who has the referee is, is tough, right? I've done it before. I had an opportunity to do it at the Georgia spring game last year as an umpire. And it's Jimbo and the boys hanging tough down there. That's Pass goes over. When Texas A&M scored the touchdown prior to the two-point try, and the crowd here was very excited, thinking possibly Clemson was going to get beat. But it doesn't happen. There's a run. Not, not doing too well this year, but Clemson still, obviously, their playoff hopes very much alive, and I think if they go undefeated, they'll obviously be in the playoff. Davis. Yards tonight total for Auburn. Carried out of his own end zone by Cook. Probably not going to have quite as much time as he had against Miami. This is a... This Auburn team right here is a different animal on the defensive side of the football. Off cooking. 